we fail. But screw your courage to the sticking place and will not fail. When Duncan is asleep, where to the rather his days long journey shall so soundly invite him? His two chamberlains will I, with wine and mussels so convince that memory, that great warder of the brain, is but a foon, and the receipt of reason a limbeck only. When in swinish sleep, their drenched natures lies as if in death. What cannot you and I perform on the unguarded Duncan? What not put upon his spongy officers who shall bear the guilt for our great quell?